Good morning, I'm Beth Ebersole with SAS, here to talk about the SAS Visual Analytics app. You can use this app to look at your reports on Apple iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch, or Android tablets and smartphones, or Windows devices. You'll simply install the SAS Visual Analytics app, and then you'll be able to look at some sample reports or even your own reports that you can download. The first step is to open the App Store. I'll search for Visual Analytics and select Get. Install. Add my password and select Sign In. And open. I won't allow notifications. SAS Mobile BI is now SAS Visual Analytics. I can see new sample reports that demonstrate powerful analytics and sleek report design. I can access viewer controls, context menus, and the information view via pullout tray. And here are my sample reports. I can open these reports, swipe, through to see the different pages in the reports. I can drill down, or I might want to add my own report. In the top left corner, I select Add, and here I'm going to add a connection. See the Add in the bottom left corner. I'll put my server number I'll select the port number 80 and next. I'll add my user ID and password. I'll select next. I will not enable Esri Premium Services and I select done. Now I can go to my folder and see there are all my reports. I'm going to open my report number 8, Beth Controls with Different Data. I'll select the plus. The plus sign downloads the report to my device. That used to be done with the subscribe button, but now we use the plus. I'll click on my report to open it and select open. This report was created by Terry Patsalaris. You can see I can select March or October and see it updates automatically. I can also use voice recognition to do this. So you see the little bubble at the top right corner. I'll select that bubble. It asks if I want to access speech recognition and I'll say OK. And now you see I have a microphone. It's going to ask if I want to let it access my microphone and I'll say yes. Filter by the year 2010. So you see it was able to use just my voice to update the report for just 2010. I'll show you again. Filter by the year 2011. So it's just that easy. I can also annotate my report. See this ellipsis at the top right? There's an annotate button. And here I can pick a pen. Maybe I want to select red. And perhaps I want to send this to someone. I'll circle May and say, let's review May. I can also highlight certain things of interest. Maybe I'm most interested in games. And maybe I'm going to send it to my colleague using this little arrow at the top right. And I'll send it to my colleague and we'll schedule a meeting to review uh, the results for May. For more information, check out the SAS documentation. My name's Beth Ebersole with SAS. I hope this was helpful.